So log into Lulu or create an account and then go up to my project. So if you've already created a project, they will appear here and it's easy to click revise, but I'll show you starting from scratch because it ends up the same anyway. So if you want to start one from scratch, click create a project. Now to set up the product listing on Shopify first and then it will be print book and scroll down to select a goal. Now you want to publish your book so click on that and it will always auto populate with what you don't want so you want Lulu Direct so click on that and then deselect the other two. It might take you a little bit of time now I pop back to Shopify and I copy and paste my title because it finds it through the title. So you have to have precisely the same title. So put that in then select a language, select a category. It doesn't, this is only if you were to be selling on something else, but you've got to fill it in to proceed. Then design the project and this is typically quite fast. My internet is a bit slow. Upload your PDF file. Then that shouldn't take terribly long. And then you pick your specs. And then it won't take you long and you can upload your cover file now. Don't worry about any warning messages. It just means it's in process. And here you have a nice preview image. And then click review book. It brings up all the specs and you can confirm and publish. Now, if you've already done all this, this is the part where these two merge. This is where you actually add it to the store. Now, when you get the success, you scroll down. And it will have, I have several stores and they're all listed under here. So you'll see the Shopify icon. You go across and you click add to store. And then even though it's up here, you still have to do this, connect an existing product. And then it'll want you to search it. So even though it's up here, you'll have to search it and it won't let you copy and paste. And here we have it. Just click on it. And then you go connect. I'll show you an extra step. So it's now connected and you can see it there. But go to settings and then go to shipping and delivery. Now you don't need to do this if you have Lulu live rates and I do have Lulu live rates on my store, but I have to do this because 
I also at one point point had book fault and then this makes it necessary to do this as well. So I click here and then manage products and then search for the product. The Halloween mystery spell there and done and always remember to click save up the top I say that because I sometimes forget but always click save up the top and that is all you have to do but I will show you something just to double check Now go here and edit locations and to make sure Lily Direct is the, lo the correct location and click save. Make sure you have entered a weight. And again, save and that's all there is to it. Now, as I said, if you're if you already have something and you want to figure out how to connect it, you just go to my projects and you can just click revise and do it all again. The second part I showed you. Mm -hmm.